Nigerian women don't like made in Nigerian products again. Check their hair. Brazilian hair. Cambodian hair. Peruvian hair. Indian hair. Now, if you ask them why all this foreign hair, they will say it is real human hair. I beg, on a hair, on my hair. Check their shares made in Turkey, shoe, Italian leather, from London use, even to cook soup, Cameroon pepper. What is <laughs> What is Nigerian product do now? You know, if you check these days, men, now we they work for the money. You go see man go work hard for the money, but you go stingy to yourself. <laughs> man go one bab hair, man one bab hair. Your own hair, oh, you go follow baba they play, you want, you want to relate with the baba. So now go become friends, make you for prize them. Your own hair. Man go bab hair 300 naira. 300. You go carry that hair three months. That same man, oh, that same very man, go pay for your girlfriend hair 50,000. <laughs> oh, that's a very day, bab. <laughs> now let you stay. You're a liar. <laughs> we just have what they see. This is what they know bab wear. Go collect your change. Oh, this is now under Naira hair, the Babio. Oh. <laughs> now you go see, man go pay for woman hair fifteen thousand for some girls. So the hair no cost, oh. The woman go carry the hair for one week. Is it good? Women are wicked. <laughs> the people are heartless. God will judge you people. At the time, my babe, if I can cut my hair for three hundred Naira and carry it for three months. If I give you 15,000 plates, you can have 15 years. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> For real. So you don't understand what they talk. This year must, this I hair must reach next year. <laughs> no, this one, this one said the petition, you know they bad, you know they do expensive hair. That is why you did not break up. Because <laughs> many guys don't break up. I'm so surprised to see guys with their girlfriends. And the guys who don't break up, the guys who don't plate hair. Because that hair, how they collect our money, that hair make us a break up. That hair go gone. You don't like that for a chest. The guy has been behaving well, Avi. <laughs> <laughs> See pure love. Oggy Waka Neku, he's irresponsible. To have a girlfriend in January. January 2nd, you're a good man. Clap for yourself. <laughs> I'm going to clap for this guy. You know, so that this January, now, guys, go to. They're going to prepare speech. Speech to apologize to the guys they broke up with. Don't they cram out, you know, it was the work of Satan. <laughs> with a life for, for Satan here, though. I heard something came up. <laughs> <laughs> Some guys went as far as telling their girlfriend that they have HIV. <laughs> Just to break up. And some girls, we care. They say, it's not HIV. I mean, if I have it now. <laughs> Now, one of the reasons why many guys are not married. Now be said that they fear marriage. Oh. Now married men, they threaten boys they never marry. If say one man asks me, excuse me, what do you know about marriage? Can you feed a woman? It's not about feeding women. You know how many girlfriends where they feed? You know how many girls they buy pepper soup for? Why let those boys they fear not be not be marriage on a wedding with a fear? Wedding on your wedding day, you go feed person you don't know. Now, person you know, invite call your wedding, you know, now you go go to the gossip for house. Man, the meat no big, that's no better food person. They invite you now. What do you make boys they fear wedding? You no, know? now what do you with the fear be that? Now, I want to advise you if you want to do wedding in Lagos, most. Most Lagos boys and the secret what do they do? You go see your guy, your guy go do wedding on Facebook, you go see him. Your neighbor, my neighbor don't do wedding before on Facebook you see the wedding. People do wedding now on Facebook. Secret wedding. If you try secret wedding in Lagos, no matter how secret you plan that, the people must come. One of my friends do secret wedding for a Jota. Instead of him to go far, do secret wedding for a Jota. The boy invites only 50 people and he cooked two dedicates of rice. <laughs> for a man, people don't come for that wedding. Now, maybe in best man. When we come out for church service, as we reach reception, now this guy see 500 people, now the boy faints. <laughs> like I said, why you faint? He said, how do I feed these people? 
Ask her one question. Is the, is the food the problem? He said yes. I can't ask her, did you invite them? He said no. I said, don't worry, don't go chop. Now, me serve that as myself. I turn the rice to Holy Communion. <laughs> I will carry one plate of rice. I go drop on here. Bam. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight of you come and join them here. <laughs>